T-Mice. It's a pretty cool brand. They make a keyboard that's just like the house that I grew up in, Modular. It's a regular keyboard that you can put stuff onto and take off of pretty easily. So I've got a box from them here. We're gonna check it out. Game on it, talk about the features. Let's get into it. Ooh, you can see the aluminum. Ooh, the keys. Ooh, the keys are really nice. Very satisfying. Okay, let's take it out. It's got some really nice weight to it. Like you could probably hit somebody with this and it would do some damage, you know what I mean? Okay, so we got on the bottom, there's your little magnetic attachment. Maybe they make like a wrist rest attachment or something. I don't know, I missed out on that one. A little bit of rubber there, maybe to facilitate the, you know, the two pieces hitting each other constantly. So there's no like scuffs, I don't know. There you have more magnetic accessory on the side. There's the back, you got the rubber and then another magnetic, and then the side, you got the same thing. And this is the back. This looks the sickest, look at that. Isn't that freaking cool? You got little rubber feet right there, and then one right here, and then this thing like, ah! Ooh, good thing I had a good grip on that. And this is also just a magnet. And then, yeah, you have the type A on one side, and then you have the little magnet, and that's how you charge it. That's sick. Like kind of, kind of looks like the old like iPod Nano charger or whatever. You know what I mean? Function bars next. Eh? Isn't that cute? This is so adorable. Look at that. Look at that tiny little line of numbers. Isn't that cool? This is like one of a kind, bro. Tell me another company that does this. This is super freaking creative. Look at that. Got a little sticker to peel even for the sticker aficionados. Some people like leaving those on. You're crazy. It charges through on this thing, right? But then this also plug into that thing. So I'm like, how charge? Can you charge through this? And you can, there's pass through. Hold on, can I just like stick this in the side? <laughs> the magnet's really strong. Okay, hold up. Let's go, baby. We got the T keyboard, T mice, get it? T keyboard, I'm sorry, this is probably breaking it, but it was worth the meme, it works. In case you're curious, it works. Next up, we're gonna do the number pad because I like that one more and I like to save the best one for last, so. All right, I haven't seen it yet, is it cool? Tell me, and tell me right now. Wow, and it's got the little thingy on it so you know where the five is in case you don't wanna look. Look at the little foot, that's a door, I guess that makes sense because it has to be the same height. Look at that. It's so tiny. It's like a little phone. Hello? 911. Hello? This tech reviewer is super cringe and boring. Can we go to the next one, mom? Wrong number. That's not bad. And I'm gonna stick it on the top. I have the tallest T mice keyboard in the world. Just wait because. Aw, oh, you can't connect it through, bro. Come on, dude. That's kind of cringe, dude. I wanted to make a T mice tower. Sorry, I'm getting a little out of hand here. All right, and then we just stick it on to the side. I guess it only goes on one side, because there's only one. Wow, that's so sick! Last thing, it's upside down again. T-Mice, and this thing is the coolest part, I think. Little volume knob, multi-functional device. Little shortcut buttons for editing, or your go-to apps. Whatever, dude, who cares, bro? I ain't using my mouse, you don't need that anymore. This is all you need. Boom. Beautiful. Admit it. Oh, that's super sick, actually. And it's got the little footy on the back. Yes. Very nice. These are silent. Well, as silent as possible. And then there's the full package, ladies and gentlemen. Look at that friggin' beast. That's beautiful. I really like that a lot. That looks like futuristic, man, doesn't it? That's so sick, dude. It goes together so smooth. I love it. This is so useful. 
The one thing that I worry about this, obviously, is if you're the kind of person that just likes to do this all the time. I wonder how long these connections will last. I'm sure they'll last a long time, but like, this, the top part, it's really, the magnet is like extra strong. I don't know why. It's like way stronger than these two, so it's really hard to take off. So once you put this one on, might as well just leave it on, I guess. I don't know, it's real hard to take off. But these little dudes, pretty great. We got RGB in the number pad here, here and in the wheel very nice uh let's try and set one of this up dragon action from the right website website title let's say i'm trying to set this up for a website noodle we'll just do a noodle button right and then we'll go noodlenick.com boom like it showed up right away look at that that's sick yes that's all the uh little links and stuff set up set the knob up set the little buttons up your little macro keys you could do all kinds of stuff you could change your windows in obs if you want to switch scenes in obs this is your number pad here on your left and then i mean your um this part and then you have your keypad which is you know your main keyboard and then you have five different profiles so you could just set up a bunch of different ones so i'm just going to keep it on one and then you go down here and this is your lighting looks like there's five different modes that's mode one that's cool Mode two, three, four, five, five is just off. Okay, and then you can change the color, make it blue, make it pink, make it purple. Oh, and then you have macro keys, which I'm not gonna set up, but those are pretty cool. If you know about macros, they got them. If you don't know, you don't need to know. I don't see any controls for this top one, only this, and this and this but not this but maybe that connects to this i don't know now that we've gone through the features and whatnot let's get into some gameplay and i promise i won't just play cloak and dagger again this time <laughs> ow love a rival ow if anybody takes jeff i'll scream Ooh, you know what's nice about this keyboard already is that the space bar is like real short does that make sense like, I don't have to push as hard. You know, the space bar is like the most important one. I'm hitting that more than like almost anything. I guess A, D, and space probably get hit the most. Because even W, you don't have to hit that one as much. You just hold it down. Yee. Jif, jif, jif. Beep, 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 beep. I'm gone. Come through, bro. Come through, dog. Come through, dog. What's up, bro? Come on through. What's up, bro? Get sniped. Get sniped. Noise. Ah, whoa. Oh, that's friendly mood night. Ah, yo, what the? Who's doing that? Stop. What's happening? What is that? Buddy, how's it going? <laughs> no, I wanted to heal. Why won't this hit?
Bye. <laughs> I kidnap. See you later. Hey, you coming back? You coming back? Oh. Oh no. Whoa, 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 whoa. Kill Venom, kill Venom. Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. Yeah, come through. Come on through, bro. I got a hose for you. Don't mess with the amazing Stupid Venom. Why is this not hitting him? Nice. Kill their healer, yes. Kill Spider-Man. Bro thinks he's him. Come on, baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Did we win? Did we win? Be honest. Did Team Ice, did team ice get us there, bro? Let's go. Yes. Oh. Oh. Slavic beef. Yes. Slavic beef. Let me, let me, got Slavic beef number one. Slavic beef number one. Yes. It's one eight two. I'll oh, take it. Modular keyboard. It's freaking awesome, man. It feels really nice to game on. The fact that you can just take the number pad off whenever you want is sick. The, sh the keyboard shortcuts, like a built-in Steam Deck on a on a keyboard, is actually insane and super useful and pretty easy to set up compared to uh, like we have an Elgato Steam Deck. And guess what, buddy? That shit's sitting in my closet because it's actually really hard to set up. There's like a bunch of extra stuff you have to download from like a website and like there's a bunch of extra steps and none of that's necessary in in this. So that's pretty nice. But this thing is awesome, man. I definitely highly recommend recommend check it out you know you like a full-size keyboard but only sometimes check it out and if you want a steam deck it's real easy to set up that you could just slap onto your keyboard I, re I think this thing is really nice i really like the back of it and the little metal bars like the little uh kickstand for it it's just it's just one of a kind bro and i don't get to i don't get to review keyboards like this very often cool ones that are just very different like this so definitely check it out i'll leave a link in description smash like subscribe see you in the next tech review and make sure to watch watch the minix if you like marvel rival watch the minix video that uh foldable portable monitor video if you feel like continuing on i'll put that one on the screen check that one out that one's pretty funny get a good intro and uh yeah i'll see you guys in the next one bye 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 Bye, team my CEO. Thank you. And everyone else, bye.